everyone. Um, so this video is to walk you guys through how each week's module will be set up um, and kind of to walk you through your first week of work here. So your course is going to look a little bit different than this. I, I'll put a design on this before I'm done publishing it. But um, essentially you guys are working through, you've done your course introduction. So you've done everything in here with the syllabus, the course calendar, the syllabus quiz, etc. Um, you've come over here to the course content and you'll be doing your first week, your first unit, which is week one. So you'll click into unit one, week one, and at the beginning of each unit, you'll see an overview of your assignments, your readings, every, your assessments, um, the dates, and the clear due date for you guys. So this week, everything is due by Sunday, July 15th. So you'll click in, and the first thing you'll see at the top is a to-do list. So you always have a to-do list that is organized with color. Um, so anything in blue is a reading assignment. Anything in yellow is something that is graded. Um, so you'll see that we have clear sections here. These are not links, by the way. Um, I have students who try and click it and don't understand why it doesn't go anywhere. It's just a list. It's just to help you stay organized. Um, but as you can see, you'll have a couple of different folders this week. You'll have a Mark Twain folder where you'll have a biography, a reading, a little quick Prezi lecture, and then you'll do a blog. And then you'll come back out and you'll go to the, the Booker T. Washington folder and you'll see a biography from YouTube, a reading assignment, and a mini quiz. And then you'll do a, a choice of reading from an early feminist literature folder, um, and then a quick discussion board with that. And then you'll watch your video explanation and look at your essay assignment. And then you'll do your mini essay by Sunday at midnight. So. Everything is going to be due each week by Sunday at midnight. Um, so you have all week to finish everything in here. Um, so the first thing you're going to do is you'll see that there's an, you'll go down the, the list basically top to bottom in each module. And you'll see that everything is organized with a folder. So the first thing you have is an optional folder here. It's just extraneous information if you need it about sort of the basics. Um, I've given you a document here that kind of is, walks you through basically all of the basics of grammar. Um, there's a video explanation to go with it, and within that, there's another there's another one that's an MLA guidelines. So it'll give you the MLA guidelines in a document and a walkthrough video. So that's optional. If you don't need it, um, to navigate backwards, all you have to do is go up here to the top, and you can navigate all the way back. You can always come back over here to course content and click back through. Um, so the first real folder you need to worry about is the Twain folder. So I'll go into the Twain folder. I'll see there's a biography, which I'll, I'll skim. Um, I'll read, do the readings. This is a short poem um, from Twain. And then I'm going to watch the Prezi. All I have to do is click play. It'll, sometimes it's a video lecture. Sometimes it's a Prezi. Sometimes it's a, a PowerPoint. Um, but I'll click through, and I'll see that all I have to do is just follow this. And it gives me the Prezi lecture. Um, when I'm done with that, I'll go to my, my assignment. So whenever I have an assignment, um, it will have a icon on the left um, and a, a bold underlined, underlined title. And it'll tell you blog, discussion board, writing assignment. Um, so what I'll do is I'll click in and it'll take me to whatever that platform is. And for me, this is a blog, so I see my prompt right here, and it says I need to do a one to two paragraph response. It gives me the questions, and it tells me how it'll be graded. So I create the blog entry, I do my title, I type my blog, and then I post my entry. When I'm done, I go back to my course content, I'm in unit one, week one, and I go on to my next folder. So I do the same thing with Booker T. Washington, same thing. I have a biography, a reading assignment, and then I have a mini quiz. So when I go to do my mini quiz, I will come in here, I'll click begin, and then I'll take my quiz. Um, and then of course, the last thing I'll do is I'll come back through, and I will click the early feminist literature one. So this one has instructions for me. It says choose one of the folders. Once the reading is done, come back and finish to this folder and click the discuss, finish, do the discussion board. So I want to read, say, um, Charlotte Perkins Gilman. So I read her biography. I'll do the reading assignment. I'll watch the lecture. And then I'll go back and finish my discussion board. So same thing. It gives me the prompt. I'll click in. And I'll create my own thread, just like I did at the introduction. 
and then I do my, my submission and click submit. And then when I am all done for the week, um, actually there's one more thing you have to do first, I'm sorry. Um, so you are going to have your first mini essay due this week. So you'll click in, you'll see there's an assignment sheet. So I'll open and save the assignment sheet. I'll click this link and then I'll watch the video explanation as well. And then when I'm done and I've written my mini essay, um, I'll go in here to, to submit um, my essay. So what I do is I click in. You can always find these links always over here too as well, but it's easiest just to go through the module. Um, so it gives me the, all the instructions at the top. Basically what I have to have is a Word document. Um, so I will go in, I'll have my Word document, I'll browse my computer, select whatever my document is. Um, so let's, let's just say I need a document here. Um, apologies, so I'll go to TCC and I will do this document. I choose it and then when I'm done, I need to click that I agree to the Safe Assigned Database and I'll click Submit. Um, once I've submitted it, I should be able to see my document um, that I've submitted on the page. So if I can't see it, then my professor can't see it. So you can resubmit as many times as you need up until the deadline. Um, the, the link will close at the midnight deadline, but you can submit as many times as you need up until that, and I'll just grade the last submission. So if you have any questions about that, let me know, but otherwise that will be your first week. Um, and then once you're done, you're done. You can go on to the next unit if you like. Just come back to the course content page and then go into unit two and start with week two. Um, if you want to wait, you can wait and pick it up again Monday morning. Um, but otherwise, you guys should be good to go.